Um, can you please tell your sweet angel that she's in the world with you and she needs her? Hey, Faith Chronicles family. Thank you guys so much for your love and your support. We hope that you continue to enjoy our channel. And don't forget to check out our merch at BigChroniclesMerch.com. And if you go about your day today, remember, remember to, to always let love, love lead, lead the way. way. Mommy, mommy. Yes, Molly, what is it? I want to draw, Mom. Where's your sister? She already left for work. Please, Mommy, please. I have so many great ideas and I want to draw them. Okay, okay, Jesus. I wouldn't have to put your things away if you would put them away yourself. You're really gonna have to start putting your stuff together away, Molly. Serious. I will put them away, Mom, please. That's what you say and you never do. I'm tired. I need to get at least another hour of rest. You know I gotta do those YouTube exercise videos. That's the only way I can make enough money to support you, your sister, and this house. Okay, I will put it away. Now please, Mom. <sighs> and? And I'll clean my room today. I promise. Hey, so are you ready to go? Yes, I am. I have my bag ready. I didn't mean for this to happen. All I asked you to do was clean your room. Grace, she didn't mean for this to happen. All I asked was for her to clean her room. Now I'm going to support our family. Let's go back in the room so you can get some rest. Pay the bills on her own, so they lost their home. Molly went to live with her dad and blamed herself for the rest of her life for what happened to her mom. Grace did heal and was able to start fresh 10 years later. Here's what could happen if Molly just listened to her mom. Come in, mom. Hey, my little star, you ready to go? Yes, daddy, but can you give me a few seconds so I can share to my room? Uh, sure, go right ahead, sweetie. Almost forgot these. Good girl. Those could have caused some serious harm if you left them on the floor. 
Are y'all packed up and ready? Yes, Mom. I'll see you later. Bye. The moral of the story is, your parents don't tell you things to bug you. Sometimes it's for safety reasons. Always be obedient and do what your parents tell you.